the F just happened there? Alright, well, I'm still there. Sorry for that. Stupid. Um... Okay, so now Moog can talk. Alright, so the Yeti needs to be dealt with. No, stream's back. Stream's back. I, I messed that up. That was me. I don't know how that happened, but... When I tried to get the name to go in for Mog, uh, it just shut the stream down. So I hit the enter button, and it was on the end stream. That's on me. Alright, so now that I've done this, I should be able to exit here somehow. I don't believe we have any way of exiting other than the traditional way. We want to go up and get Tridoc. I think we need Terra to do that. Alright, let's let's take some measures. We're about to get paid in the Escalade here. Come on, get away. I hate running in this game it's so bad. It's not like that in the SNES version. They just run away. It's like they calculate it differently. Uh, they, can, they can review it however positively they want to. They're wrong. It, it's just... That if you don't think that there's money changing hands, you're wrong about that too. There is. There have been several very bad reviews of Final Fantasy Origins as well. Like, Rock Paper Shotgun's review was one star out of five. So, there's some people reporting the truth about that game. And the reality is, it's actually about a two out of five star game. If you really like Neo and you only want to do combat in corridors that are just copy-pasted all over the place, and you want to experience a bunch of weirdo... Um, a bunch of weirdo dialogue, then it, th that is something you can do with it, making it worth more than one star, in my opinion. Rock, Paper, Shotgun, they actually were harsher than I am to it. But it, it's a horrible game. It really is. You can't... It, it, it's, a, it's a disrespect to the, to the series as a whole. It really is. The disrespect is about the poor programming and all of the lack of care. I need to do something. I just gotta remember after I, I know I'm running again, but it, it is quicker. I need to put a uh, ward bangle on. Welcome. You have every right to do that. I, I wonder if you'll be able to stomach it through to the end. It gets very repetitive. It is pretty corny, but you can also just go on YouTube and watch all of the FMV sequences one after another in a row without having to play the game. So you can still give yourself that and you don't even have to pay for it. Obviously you have paid for it, so... What, what makes me sad is that because you bought that game, they got income and they're going to do it again. That's how they're going to handle things, because you have given the dog a treat after it performed its trick incorrectly. Basically that dog bit me, and then you were like, oh, here, have some money. So that sucks. God, this is taking forever. I hate running in this game. I think it would have been faster to fight this. I'm not going to spoil the ending for you, Cump, but I've seen the ending, and, uh... Let me just say, chaos is involved. <laughs> There's definitely some chaos. Alright. I didn't play through to the end, I wouldn't suffer through that, but I mean, like I said, you can watch the game. If you, if you think that the story is worth a look, you don't have to play it. Alright, abilities. No, equip. We don't want to use a Genji user. Yeah, we can take this ribbon. Put this on instead. And then we should be able to encounter half or less of these encounters. So what getting Mog is going to do for us is allow us to go without any encounters anymore.
uh, gutter moog, I could take a picture of the actual box. <laughs> like, I just showed it to you guys. I can scan it. Like, it's, it's got cellophane on it, but I think... It's, I think I can do that. If that's something you really want. Oh, that FF6 uh, copy is for uh, Famicom. I'll, I'll bring her... She's asleep. This is gonna take forever. Oh, for God's sake. This is just ridiculous. She's confused, too. I absolutely hate this game. Alright, I'm gonna go get the box. Ugh. green screen is messing with it, and the solophane, but this is it. I can scan it and put it in the Discord. This is what it looks like, though. And then the back looks like this. And you can see that cartoony Terra that they made in the uh, mobile games. I mean, it came right from the original design. So... This is, this is painful. It's painful. What the hell? Alright. Well, it has some shrimp shit. The There's most, nothing better to this do. This is the most fucking diary shit. Yep, this see you later, man. The market. My fucking special dish. Look at this this guy's shit. just F. This is the most fucking diary shit. I don't know what that means. I'm sorry to say uh, your internet may have some uh, issues. That sucks. But anyway, yeah, watch the VOD. No worries. The love of F, don't do this. They won't actually attack him at all. It's just this is this is horrific. Never run away in this game. I say it and then I don't follow my own fucking instructions, but Run away. Thank you. Jesus. That was horrible. All right. I'm traumatized from that. Alright, we need to get out of here. Oh, I shouldn't be running, remember? That is probably true, but making it green was a good call. The green hair just fits. But yeah, the original Japanese version in the end had the green hair, for sure. Alright, our problems with random encounters are about to come to an end. We just gotta get out of here somehow.
Yeah, they did. They messed it up bad. Someone's got a mod and fix that, honestly. And hopefully... I mean, I've seen the amount of mods. They're impressive. The things that they can do, they're impressive. So, at some point, I'm going to figure out how to deal with the API in this thing and, and make my own fun. Because, like, going into editing the hex code of a Super Nintendo game does not sound like a good time. But this PC port, I'm sure, is not hex coded, and I can probably get in there and get a lot of things done very quickly without having to make all of these convoluted hex if statements and stuff. I can't, I mean, I can do it, I just don't want to do it, so. I am excited about the possibility of modding these uh, pixel remasters in ways that are absolutely awesome. Okay, so we gotta go get uh, this Moogle, and now is the time we're gonna start getting, uh, getting lit. Go get some really impactful items. Now that we don't ever encounter enemies, the 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 sky's the limit, literally. So once we get all those items, we will essentially be able to make invincible characters. So the race is on at this point to get get paid in the Escalade. The first stop, Kefka. Yep, you heard me right. We're going to fucking Kefka's Tower first. There it is. We're gonna have to go in several times here to do this, right? Who cares what happens to Terra? She ain't here. Okay, so this is going to be a smooth operation from front to back. Get in, collect the crap, get out. Simple. It's like Navy SEALs. Shit. Well, this music is going to be awesome, but we're just going to have to hammer through this because I've only got 23 minutes, and we need to get as uh, geared up as possible. The L button. Okay. That's not the L button. Ah, it's the L2 button. Okay, we should be good. This music is so good.
There's some secret here. There we go. Wow, this is complicated. Okay, excellent. I believe we've gotten all we can get from this side of the run. So we go back up in the air again and do this again with Mogus the second player. Well, it's going to be done soon enough, but I'm glad you're not mad about it. I mean, this is what I want to do. Alright, so we just got really good shit there. We're going to do it again. One, two, three. We're going to take this next 20 minutes and we're going to get so many items. It's going to be obscene. I am out of just the... No, I'm not. Never mind. I was out of the pure abundance of caution going to save, but I'm not. So, hopefully we don't see any uh, surprises. Here we go again. We get the truncated version of this now that we've seen the whole scene play out. <sighs> Let's see what other treasures we can get. Oh, there was one. That Aegis Shield, though, was the most important item to get out of all of these items. That was an important one. That helps with the Colosseum a whole lot. You have to be very careful about this. Okay, he can't go anywhere until that happens, so... Alright, we gotta get number two, and then we're done. So, push this. Push this. I really want beer. You remind me of something I'm not allowed to have right now. I checked it out and you were correct. Uh, Sam has uh, Sam has gone on the path to sobriety, which is, in his case, probably a good thing. So I hope that all works out. Oh, thank God they ran away. This is not the right party to have. I did not expect to be attacked immediately when I came down here. I just wanted to save. Do this again. As for the Christian thing, that whole thing... Maybe. I don't know what's going on with that. People use Christianity. That's what I've found in my life. Priests use it to make money. Uh, People use it to network, gain control over other people, and there's a lot of things that it gets used for, and then there are some people who use it to uh, give themselves uh, some reassurance that death is not to be feared. There's a bunch of uses for it, but from my experience, Christianity is not something that, um, that people use in a selfless manner, so... That's, that's, it should be, the fucking concept of it is exactly that, but, no, it's, it's in general used by people. I don't know what, what the angle is with that, and I, I don't care. It's his personal choice. Religion is always a personal choice to someone, but I have my doubts any time that someone, uh, 
changes their faith to Christianity. Because there's almost always a reason behind it. I do. Absolutely have the... I definitely have Homeless in Japan. 100%, yes. I have all that stuff. Of course. Great question. That was a good one. That was one of the best episodes. For production value, anyway. Looting Kefka's tower of all its beautiful shit. Look at that Minerva. That's what I'm talking about. Now Terra can also absolutely own. Hey, Oddity, is there any reason to fight this thing? Like, does it give you something? I don't think it does. So, I'm a little confused about that one. For real. I don't think you need to fight that at all. I don't think there's any reason to fight at my weapon. I think there used to be. I don't really know. That's the pinwheel spot. I love how a lot of the, the old rooms from the Magitech castle and the um, Vector castle are reused, like that cell that Kefka used to be put in. Now having the ult the uh, the uh, ultimate weapon or the Atma weapon or whatever you want to call it. There is a very important get right there. I think that's everything we need at this point from from this. Might as well. That's also awesome. I'd forgotten about that. So we got two more exits. Is this where we came out of? Man, that's a good one too. Never mind. There are two ribbons in this place. I thought there was only one. There's a ribbon at the end as well. There's a dragon. That gong sounds awesome. In this music, it's just really well done. Okay, we're done. We are done in Kefka's Tower for now. What a haul! Yeah, they, they, um, unlike, uh, Final Fantasy Origin that reuses assets to try to make deceptively large play areas, uh, this one reuses it in a way that really makes sense. Alright, next on our list of places to go is Zozo. We should do Pumbaba pretty soon get uh, Terra, but we need to do Zozo. Zozo is full of good items. And once we do Zozo, we should be very close to being able to build invincible uh, parties. Very close. I think this is it. Looks like I got 13 minutes. We have to buy Rustrid. Oh, we gotta get the party changed. That makes sense. So now that we got that hall, let's let's make some invincible people, or very close to. And they're not going to be invincible yet, but they're they're getting there. Let's make some very powerful people. We'll start with Celes because. Actually, no, let's not do that.
Okay, we'll use you. This is looking pretty good. So, we'll put on an Aegis and a Force Armor. And... We could give 100% magic evasion here. We could. But we need a better, um... There we go. Alright. That's pretty decent. So he's only gonna have to worry about physical damage. The... The Mo... The Moogle. Why? Wait. Oh, you can... Did you see that? You can go to people who aren't in there. Like, he ain't in there, but I could go to him. That's fucking weird. Alright. Uh, these Genji wearers. Gotta do Moog. Can Moog wear these things? Can Moog use a force shield? Yes. We, we've gotta change it to be... Hold on. Alright, no Genji glove for you. You get... There we go. Alright, so you basically can't be hurt by magic either. That's pretty good. And then we got you. You have a red hat coming. There it is. And yeah, you're not good yet, but that makes sense. We just haven't gotten all the shit we can get. So. Alright, that's as good as it's going to be for now. We could probably take that dragon out at this point. Let's go get Rust Rid. This is not the guy that sells it. Nope. Dead people in the streets. It's always good. I thought there was a dude. It's over here. How do I get the Rust Rid? Do I have to follow that bird? Now I'm confused. Do I have to do... Alright. Water waste, thanks for the follow. Lick a nut. You have to send Lola's letter first in Miranda before you can get this. So that's what the problem is. Miranda. Miranda is not on the map. Fun. Okay. running out of time. Thought we'd be able to get Zozo cleaned up, but now I don't know where Miranda is. Is this uh, G-Door or is this Miranda? Let's find out. Alright, I still have my memory. Let's deliver the letter.
come on, you bird. So long. At the very least, we should be landing next to it now. If we were able to follow it with our eyes that far. Oh man. It's a race against the clock at this point. To get at least to the save point in Zozo. Ice shield, fantastic. Red cap again. That's what we need. Can we jump? Nope. Thunder shield. This place is just loaded with good shit. Aegis Shield. Hell yes. Just getting paid. Alright, I did make it to the save point. I'm gonna go through the rest of this before the Thunder um, Dragon and just see if I can grab any more chests. I only have two minutes. Science up here. Ah, Alright, well can't I don't have time to go through any of that we're gonna get to that save point and that's gonna do it for today but we got a haul of crap that's for sure as soon as we're good enough we'll go get Locke and then we'll get uh, Ragnarok and all that good stuff and before long we will be unstoppable all right have a good fucking rest of your day